Closing this trading week, market participants are ready for large risky bets on some assets. The US dollar is on a track to close the week with the gains for four weeks straight. The greenback has looked at the best one month's performance in the two years. Safe Haven Gold is ready to celebrate one week gains for these weeks in a row. Moreover, the oil market is also expected to close the week in the green because oil production is in a Jeopardy. Analysts believe that the dollar could have surged by up uh, to 60% driven by expectations of Donald Trump's victory. However, the greenback has been caught uh, in a trap of extremely overbought levels. As a result, the dollar's sixth currency index opened on Friday with its largest drop in a month, consolidating within the range of 104 below to 10410. Meanwhile, the euro dollar passed rocked off bearish pressure, showing a moderate recovery in this shift in sentiment was caused by economic reports from both the Eurozone and the US. The business activity data released yesterday presented markets with some risk-taking opportunities. As expected, business activity cemented in the US economy. The services PMI rose to 55.3, while the manufacturing index climbed to 47.8 points. In the Eurozone, similar reports also showed an increase in the overall business activity, and this was a positive sign. However, instead of reaching the anticipated 50.1 mark, the index remained in the contraction zone at a 49.7, which is a downside. This disappointment was exhibited by the services sector, which usually grows, but the PMI fell to 51.2 in September. At the same time, the commonly aligned manufacturing sector bid forecast rising to 45.9 points, which is a double positive. Judging by the chart of the euro dollar pad, the growth in the business activity within the US economy was taken by the markets as expected and routine. In contrast, the data from Europe came as a big surprise to traders fueling optimism for the euro. Incidentally, Germany's business climate index published today also went up, exceeding forecast once again. It climbed to 86.5 in October for the supporting eurozone currencies. As a result, the euro dollar pan now has a chance, even not for growth, then at least for consolidation. Moreover, the US dollar remains overbought. So it makes sense to expect the euro to hold above the critical technical resistance level of 1.0805 today. If the euro begins to climb, buyers will face a test of the significant resistance level around 1.0865. Importantly, a technical indicator is point to a short-term bearish trend for the European currency. Overall, despite signs of a bullish trend, the euro-dollar pair continues to move within the downward channel. It means that the price may reverse downward at any moment. In such a scenario, the euro is likely to continue declining with a target below the technical support level at 1.0735. The euro dollar pair may get another boost today following the release of a secondary data on a new orders growth in the US. If as expected durable goods orders decline, it will likely lead to dollar selling and revive euro buying. As we previously mentioned, oil prices are also in to close the week on a positive note. Brent prices today are stabilizing within the range of $74 to $76 per barrel. Our experts attribute the quiet behavior of oil prices to the growing media focus on the looming U.S. presidential election. In any case, there are currently no major news updates on the market sentiment on oil. Thus, oil prices will likely remain around to their current levels. The BRICS summit, held from October 22 to 24, brought no significant news for the Russian currency. As a result, market participants are absorbing the Bank of Russia's interest rate decision. Following its policy meeting, the regulator raised the key rate from a 19% to 21, and this move has, of course, offered the ruble some support locally. However, even in the medium term, this sharp rate hike is expected to negatively impact uh, the overall economy, becoming another factor in the ruble's potential weakening. This effect will not be immediately, but will unfold over time. That's all for today. We continue to follow developments in financial markets. Subscribe to our channel and follow Suits with us. We wish you profitable deals and have a nice weekend. See you on Monday. You are certainly aware that BRICS is uh, striving to dethrone the US dollar. However, in reality, the greenback can boost at the benefits of being the world's reserve currency. 
and a well-established safe haven asset.